Hey guys, this is Kevin from jazztime.com. Jazztime.com is an online store that buys, sells, trades, authentic luxury watches. We make these videos where customers can easily choose the best watch for themselves in the comfort of their own home. We offer the lowest prices anywhere online, and if you want to know the price, simply click in the links in the description below. If you enjoy our videos, we would greatly appreciate it if you would buy a watch from jazztime.com once in a while. So today we'll be reviewing the Rolex Datejust 31. This is the model number 178274. We'll be going over the dial, bezel, case, crown, bracelet, clasp, and we'll talk about the movement towards the end of the video. So moving right on into the dial, the dial configuration I currently have in my hand here is the silver dial that has sort of the sunburst feature. As you can see, as I tilt it against the light, you can see the sort of light being shown in different portions of the dial with a nice contrasting uh, sunburst as well. To, and also for the index hour markers, which are the stick hour markers, are luminous, uh, luminous filled. Uh, meaning that it will glow in the dark for up to 88 hours with a highly legible, uh, highly legible display, so e easy view uh, viewability during the dark and during the day as well. The hour markers are fashioned in 8 to care white gold to prevent any tarnishing, and the same can be said about the hands with the luminous tips and 18 karat yellow gold or white gold as well. Besides that, this follows its uh, typical Datejust architecture, which is the Rolex Crown logo at the 12 o'clock position, made out of that 18 karat white gold. The Rolex Oyster Perpetual Datejust name right underneath that. The date went out the 3 o'clock position with a Cyclops lens on top of the sapphire crystal for magnification, easy reading of that date. And specifically for this Datejust, the 31s, they have the railroading on the outer edge of the dial that has the Roman numerals behind each hour marker as well. This being a date just watch, it is a very fashionable watch as it does have different numerous different configurations because it's more of a dress watch uh, as opposed to a sports piece. So the, the configurations you can get if you're not really interested in the silver dial but you do like the index hour markers, you can get it in a black, white, pink, silver, or blue dial. If you're not a big fan of the index hour markers but you're looking for more of the Roman numeral all, all around, then you can get that in a, the same colors, the black, white, pink, blue. Uh, but also you can get in a purple or brown, which are special to the uh, Roman numerals. But if you're feeling a little more luxurious, you really want to stand out with this watch, then you can also purchase it in a mother of pearl dial with diamond hour markers fashioned in the 18 karat white gold with either a white or dark mother of pearl. Moving on to the bezel now. The bezel is a very beautiful 18 karat white gold fluted bezel. Uh, the flutedness of the fluted bezel is machined in such a way that you can see that it captures light very nicely in conjunction with that sunburst, that sunburst dial. So you can see as I touch it towards the light, you have these sort of hard contrast of uh, hard contrast of shadows against the high contrast of the you know the light, and it really works nicely and it picks up the light very beautifully. And um, if you were to wear this in your car and you have the sunlight, you know the sunlight hits this fluted bezel with that sunburst dial. It kind of makes like a sort of a disco light show on the top of the ceiling of your car. It's absolutely gorgeous. Uh, that's very nicely paired with the high polish on the top lugs of the case and the bottom lugs of the case, which really makes it seem like a sort of window frame, and it has a nice bordering uh, for that dial, just that continuous shine from the high polish, the sort of um, different contrasting of the fluted bezel, and also with the sunburst dial as well, so very beautiful to look at uh, head on. Besides that, the case size is a 31 millimeter case size, so from an index finger to my thumb here, that's 31 millimeters in diameter. But specifically for the case, it's not made out of white gold like the bezel. The bezel is the only thing that is white gold on the watch itself, besides the hour markers being the fashion in any care white gold. So the rest, the bracelet, the clasp, the crown, and the case is made out of a 904L steel, which is a Rolex in-house made steel. It has additional corrosion resistance and a nicer shine to it. The profile of the watch isn't too high, won't sit very high off the wrist, so it will fit under suit cuff stress cuffs very nicely while also being a very beautiful high polish on the sides. On the other side as well, we have that same high polish on the side of the case and down to the bracelet. Rolex crown logo on the crown itself as we move on to the crown features now. It is a screw down to unlock double waterproof in the system that unwinds counterclockwise as shown. And in the standard position is where you can wind your watch. 15 to 20 winds is all you need from a dead stop to get the watch started once more. Tucking the crown out to the next position will allow you to adjust the date instantaneously as shown. You can see how simple and easy it is to change through the, change through the dates there. Pulling the crown out to the final position will allow you to adjust the hands bi-directionally and set the time however you like. But uh, in conjunction with that, we also have the second hand that's completely stopped to allow for precise time setting, such as to the next time a clock online can set it down to the exact seconds. 
Pressing the crown back in starts that second hand once more. And always make sure you screw the crown nice and tight in against the case as you want to keep this watch water resistant for 100 meters or 330 feet. Moving on to the bracelet now. Bracelet's a beautiful oyster style bracelet, which is a three piece link bracelet, high polish on the center, contrasting satin finish on the outer of the three links. Same thing for the clasp as well. You can see that down, high polish down the center. And it patterns all the way throughout. Nice tapering from the first lug downwards to the back to keep a nice proportional view for the front, but also fitting very nicely in the back as well. As we can see the curved, uh, curved clasp as well. This is the folding oyster clasp. Opening it up reveals these nicely high polished class blades with the Rolex name embossed on there. As you can see, once again, that curvature fits underneath the wrist for more comfortability with that curvature. Moving on to the movement now. The movement is housed in a simple oyster case backing. It is Rolex's in-house uh, in-house made movement. It is a perpetual mechanical self-winding movement. It is the caliber 2235 movement made by Rolex with a precision of minus 2 plus 2 seconds a day, which I like to boast about the 6 o'clock position on the dial. You can see that superlative, uh, superlative chronometer officially certified, meaning that it is within Swiss specs. Functions of the movement are the hour, minute, and second hand with the instantaneous changing the date with rapid setting and stopping a second hand as, as I've shown you with the crown functions. The power reserve of this watch is a 48 hour power reserve, meaning that you can put this watch on a Friday evening, pick it back up on a, a Sunday afternoon, and it'll be keeping time just fine. Now let me actually go ahead and show you this watch on my wrist now. So look, look for that folding oyster once more. Open that up. And there we are. So with typical Rolex, brace, uh, with typical Rolex bracelets, if it's a seven, uh, seven and a half inch wrist, my wrist is a seven inch wrist, so average man size wrist. And you can still see great wiggle room there. Fits very comfortably. You can see that dial is just absolutely gorgeous. Like I said, when you tilt it towards the light, you can kind of see that sort of contrasting of the, the light and the dark as well, patterning very nicely with the fluted bezel and a high polish on the lugs. So if you're interested in this watch or any other watch for the lowest possible price, check out our website at jazztime.com where the lowest price is guaranteed and we offer a one year warranty. If you liked the video, please like, comment, and subscribe below. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you guys soon. If you want to find out more about the watch you just saw in the video, you can just click below on show more to see the full description. Then you can check the link next to model as seen in video, click on it and you will get to the proper page where you can see all the details. If you're watching on a mobile phone, you have to click on the arrow down on the right hand side below the video to see the full description. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up. If you would like to share this video with your friends, you can use the share button below and share it on any platform you like. If you have questions, constructive feedback, want to tell us about some mistakes or misspeaks, just write a comment below. If you want to see more videos like this, you should subscribe to our channel and visit our channel page where you can find all the videos. And if you're interested in a specific watch brand, you can check out our playlists. If you want to check the price for a watch or want to buy one, remember at jazztime.com you always get a steep discount, so you should check the prices with us. If you want to know the price for a specific watch, just go to Google, type in Jazztime, plus the brand, model and the details you're interested in and Google will find the right page for you. Thank you for watching.